Hello friends, welcome back to a new video on Tecla structures, tips and tricks. Uh, in this video, I'm going to talk about the main part on, uh, in uh, an assembly. So, if I select, uh, make sure you are selecting the assembly and go to inquire and select the assembly. Here, the main part of this assembly is the angle and the assembly position is uh, VR. So, if I, if I create drawing for this assembly, if I click on create drawing assembly drawings, go to document manager. This is a new, I think it is maybe wrong here. Let me delete and create the assembly drawing. Ah, oh, sweet. As you see, the orientation of the plates are not correct because the orientation of this angle is correct here because the main part of this assembly is that angle. So, in the according to the fabrication, I don't want to have the oriented uh, plates like this because I want to have a correct uh, orientation of the plates and tell the fabricator to fix these four corner plates and uh, then weld the, the, the angles so how how should i um correct this orientation so the only solution for that problem is actually to set the plate as a main part of this assembly so let's try let me remove the drawing okay select the uh, object in assembly or object in component right click on the plate and go to assembly and set as new main part of assembly so then go to numbering setting and numbering setting make sure this number number all is not checked which is very important if you check this option it will uh, renumber all your parts and the assembly drawings so here apply an ok perform numbering only number modified objects so now if I go to inquire and select the assembly so you see the main part profile assembly is the plate so it's correct and right click and assembly sorry drawings assembly drawings go to document manager and let us see what's happening okay so as you see the orientation of the plates are correct and uh, the angles are oriented to have some slope. So this is the correct, uh, I mean, it, it's, up, uh, uh, it's up to you. Um, according to the uh, my fabricator, I want to fix this um, four corner plates and then uh, weld the angles and braces. So uh, what if uh, these, uh, these angles, these all frames in my project, um, have the main part of, of, of assemblies are the angles. So this is very, very time consuming to select every plate. Uh, select this plate, right click and set as main part. So I want to show you uh, a very tricky method. Uh, that's why I created this video exactly for this. So uh, we have a very nice tool here in uh, main parts, set main part. Thanks for uh, ILTO for creating this uh, this such a nice and um, handy tool uh, we should select all the plates and in one click set selected parts as the main part this is very handy and very fast uh, very very handy and easy to use so uh, for that I use to create a filter view so go to the uh, object group selection filter so I have created all oh, I've created uh, a group here so you, you can uh, create a new filter and uh, the category by part and profile and the value is select from the model so uh, this is, should be a view filter on or a selection filter in the model and uh, also this is not very important in drawing you can uncheck it but uh, it's very important here view filter uh, and the selection filter so save us save and apply an ok so double click on the, your screen and uh, select a visible object group to your uh, created recently uh, filter here gassets click modify so 
only the gasset plates and the bolts are showing here. So let me hide uh, the bolts here. Uh, please uncheck the and the poor um, uh, bolts. Um, select all. Right click. Uh, uh, show only selected. So the bolts are hiding now. So I want to select all these plates and set us uh, and set all plates as a main part of its assembly. But uh, actually, I don't want to. In, in, in this assembly, we have four plates. We have four plates. One, two, three, four. I want to only the, the upper plates of the of this assembly to set as a main part. So, only I, I want to show. Uh, I want to hide this. Click on hide. Here also, I don't want to the lower plates hide. So here, and hide. These two rows also, and hide. Okay. One more row. Okay, this is our correct plate to set us uh, the new part. This is the new main part. So select all. Okay, make sure the parts only object in assemblies. Okay, this is the correct parts are selected. Okay, go to the components and set and then. Uh, search for main set main part double click okay selected parts uh, set uh, selected parts as main part okay so let me check the uh, plate here go to the inquire select the assemblies and inquire inquire the plates here we go so the main part is is a plate okay so uh, let me get back to the standard view. Here, standards. And uh, redraw the view. Okay. So, mm. this is an assembly. This is an assembly. Let me check uh, assembly. Here, yeah, assembly. Yeah. It's main part profile is a PL. And the uh, assembly position is a frame. So, <clears throat> let us renumber all. Uh, not remember actually, only the modified, uh, only modified. Let me delete that. So uh, let's check the frame. Right click, some drawing. Go to document manager. And here we go. This is actually correct. As you see, it's uh, correct. The the plates are in a right position and the angles are oriented. So, hope you guys uh, get something new and learn uh, on this video. Uh, and uh, do not forget, please, to like and subscribe to, uh, to be continue. And thanks. See you soon.